You argued it, that a second no, season was not a no, choice. No, I didn't. I wrote it down. And I got you to sign it. <laughs> We're going to get a second. If I can find it. Oh! 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 This is so glorious. This is probably my most glorious moment I've ever had in my life. I'm totally forgotten about this. Oh! 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 No, you did! No, and you were so wrong! Oh! You think you're so clever because you got one sicken over on me? Uh, it was m like that was more than a sicken. It was just such a big win. <laughs> I'm going to dine out on that for a while. Just back away. I mean, they can just search some keywords. Oh, I did an impression of him for you. Yo, yo, Glenn, my man, can I get... Uh, oh, that's not necessary. Oh, that's nice. Oh my god, that's I'll nice. Mmm. Mmm. That, that one is nice. Alright. Don't freak out. You're gonna be fine. You look incredibly stupid. I always went on a walk with me, our normal walk. And at a certain point, about three quarters of the way on the walk, on the home stretch, like, she got spooked by some man. He didn't even do anything, he just spooked her. And she got away from me and was gone. Millie, are you tired? She ran straight home. Good girl. Are you tired? You're over it now, whereas I'm still like, because <gasps> I ran the whole way after you. She pulled the lead right out of my hand. Lesson learned. I'll keep a better hold on you next time. You know your way home from <laughs> a certain point in the walk. You just she just blinkers on, straight home. I rang Alex. I was like, Millie, got away from me. And he opened the door to go look for it. She was sitting there. <laughs> She's sitting there like, you going to let me in or? He scared me, honey bun. I was roaring after and she didn't come. And I was like, here, here. The whole neighborhood knows, knows my dog's name now anyway. I can't even give out to her though because she did come straight home. So I don't want her to think that coming straight home is a bad thing, so I can't even give out to her. You scared me. You scared me, honey. But I think we're going to need to do a bit more training on the hair command because once she got spooked, it was out the window. Just Claire has asked me to get some exciting vlog footage. So as we can see, this is really hard to focus. I can't focus that. Anyway, Rugby World Cup tickets at 28%, 30% progress. Screen three, 32% progress. You don't understand, Tampa. Yeah, but just show me it's your mad- girls. It's like Yorkies. Just show me your mad Tampa system no. there in your notebook. No. What are you doing now? I'm uh, in the queue to lose out on uh, Rugby World Cup tickets. I'd say, at least two of the three devices will crash out of this. I'm hoping one gets through and then I'm going to get through and there will be so much hope in my heart. And I'll go check Ireland tickets and then I'll be like sold out and then I will just be furious for the rest of the evening. We're on 39, 36, 38. It's very exciting. I really hope this one doesn't win because it's very difficult to use. Oh yeah, the mouse pad on that is nearly broken. It's like horrendous. You need to plug in a mouse. Yeah, it's really annoying. Two hours later. If yours all booted you out in the 90s, what makes you think this won't boot you out? Mine won't be booted. <sighs> Two and a half hours. But not this. They're sold out. So how did we get tickets then? We don't. They're gone. Good morning. Happy St. Patrick's Day. I have kind of an exciting morning planned. So I'm actually waiting on a call from a Canadian broadcasting network. Uh, like I got an email from them yesterday and they were like, we normally get Irish people on to talk about St. Patrick's Day and we'd like to talk to you this year. And I was like, sure. And I thought they were calling me because I was in the Maple Leafs video. So Maple Leaf, which is like a Toronto ice hockey team, reached out to me and they were like, we want to get Irish creators to react to our highlights. And I did that. God, I'd hate to be only in this because not only does it look like it hurts, but it also looks like it hurts your heart when it goes in. There's actually also a second video just come out where I like had to guess hockey slang. And so that's on their page now. So that's the links to those two videos are down below in the description. So I'm going to react here to some of the hockey slang. I'm going to guess what it means. And then I'm going to check 
what it actually means and see if I got it right. Bucket, okay. I think bucket is like, it's in the bucket means it's in the goal. Okay, so bucket is the helmet? Oh, you guys have slang for everything. But this Canadian radio station got in touch and they were, wanted me to talk about St. Patrick's Day and I thought it was because they'd seen the Toronto Maple Leafs video. But actually, your man was talking to me yesterday on the phone, like in a sort of tester call. And he was like, I've been watching you for years and I'm a big fan. And I was like, oh my God, this is, <laughs> this is so cool. Uh, it's 10 past 10 now and around half 10 they're going to ring me. And I'm going to be on the radio in Canada. <laughs> Which is different. Right, so I'm going to make tea. Um, I have to edit today because I haven't got this Living With Kira video edited yet. And Alex is off, so he's going to be bugging me all day. I think he's going to be bugging me all day. This is very frustrating. I have misplaced my little camera tripod. So I'm like holding the camera. Oh, what an inconvenience. <laughs> okay, it's 10 to i I'm like sitting here waiting for them to call me. So there's this like, this kind of meme in Ireland among Irish people. And I'm not going to do it to you because I'm, I'm way, I'm not mean enough. But basically, Irish people sometimes when they're asked to teach someone from outside of Ireland like an Irish expression, they will teach them how to say, can I go to the bathroom and tell them it's something else. <laughs> and I, the reason that we do this is because when we were in like primary school, you had to ask for things in Irish. So you had to like ask to go to the bathroom in Irish. And so it's the one phrase that everyone in Ireland remembers how to say. <laughs> The expression to go to the bathroom is on will the gum dog and leheris. And so if you ever hear anybody to tell you that and tell you it's something else, you'll know <laughs> that they're they're trying to get one over on you. Thank you so much. Happy St. Patrick's Day. So I actually left my phone on a bus yesterday and to my absolute surprise someone handed it in. So thank you to that person and thank you to Dublin Bus. I have to head over to their depot later this afternoon to pick it up. It's going to be the furthest I've gone to travel in quite some time. I also have an eye appointment today. Last time I got my first set of glasses, so I'm expecting I'm going to have to get a new set of glasses. But this eye test is free! Thank you, PRSI contributions. Cha-ching! Socialism. Socialism. <laughs> yeah, so we can do nothing today. For St. Patrick's Day, unfortunately. Apparently the guards are gonna be out on horses. They posted on their Instagram today. A veiled warning. I'd say loads of people are down by the canal drinking, people are meeting, people are meeting all over the shop. It's officially in this level, we're not supposed to meet anyone, but people are meeting all over the place. I've done this like ponytail hack where it's actually two ponytails, very gentle marbles. I'm not really getting away with it though, unfortunately. Right, I'm gonna make myself a goatee and I'm not gonna make Alex a goatee because the other day we got into a fight because he didn't make me a goatee. And I could be better than him and make him a goatee. No, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> yeah, I'm making myself a goatee. A goatee? Yes, a goatee. I'm making like, myself- Okay, will I get a marker? No. Um, I'm making myself a goatee, goatee. and you're not getting one. Goatee. A goatee. T to, a go, tea to go is what people would say. Yeah, but it's longer. Goatee. A goatee is goatee. easier to say. Goatee. It's my thing. Goatee. TM. Goatee. Trademarked. No, don't make yourself one. I'm then making no, myself one. No, I was making you said a you're... point. I was making yeah, a point. Yeah, but I'm making myself one. You didn't get one because you didn't make me one the other day. We had a huge fight in the first year of our marriage. Huge he did, fight? Because he didn't make me toast one time when we were drunk. It was the biggest fight we ever had in the first year and this is like, it's gonna get up there and you're not making me tea when you're making yourself a goatee. Cut the grass. You need to it's fuck off. <laughs> Dude, he's got the grass. They're talking to a woman who's in a Hong Kong quarantine <laughs> camp. She's from Ireland. And then she was like, there's no Wi-Fi. And he goes, oh my God, you can't even watch Netflix. She's like, no hell no. <laughs> I changed my lip balm because the red was a bit much. And then I also changed my outfit because we made the mistake of lighting a fire in the back garden and I stank of fire. What? And then I was like, oh, I'm gonna wear my Kira coat. Ooh. I actually kind of still smell like fire. The mask in particular, but I don't have time to worry about it. All right, I'm at Dublin Bus Central and let's hope this is my phone they have in here now. There's the guard to stop outside as well, so they're gonna be like, where are you going? What are you doing? <laughs> How are you going? <laughs> How's your mama? Yes! I can't believe that I got it back! He had already there for me and everything. <laughs> oh my god! Ah! How lucky!
lucky, sorry, I've got a mask on. How lucky am I? Thank you so much to whoever handed this in to the bus driver, and if it was the bus driver that found it, thank you for getting it before anyone else could. Thank you to Jackie in the Dublin bus. Like main depot, you guys are legends. I actually can't believe that I got this back. Uh, thank you so much. That is just Dublin bus man. Dublin bus man. Thank you guys so much. The minute I realized it was gone, I was like, right, do I ring the depot and report it or do I bother? Like it's probably already gone. You know, so that is just unreal. I'm so happy about that. I was like, it's in a glittery case and it has a pop socket on the back, says 15 on it. And then he was like, yeah, I have your phone. <laughs> I'm so excited because I use this as a work phone because it's actually better for so many of the apps like TikTok, all that. I actually noticed that in the day that I didn't have it, I downloaded two videos from TikTok and uploaded them as YouTube shorts. And then I only realized afterwards that the fucking uh, quality on them is shite. You have to download them on the iPhone and upload them from the iPhone as shorts. Because uh, quality is shit balls. otherwise. <laughs> okay, anyway, I gotta go, I gotta get back home. Although I don't wanna go through the Garda stop. Oh, I'm scared, I hope I don't get in trouble. <laughs> I had to come pick it up though, I wouldn't have got it back if I didn't. Shit, there is a massive accident here. They've actually blocked off a whole section of the motorway. Yikes, that must have been bad. Bye bye Paddy's Day Makeup.